I think people should just be natural about these kind of things. I think we as Muslims have started to mask our insecurities, not just now for a good while, we've been masking our insecurities through religion. <laughs> you know, like I had this guy once tell me that, do you know, like somebody went to, somebody told me this, this is a true story. Somebody told me that, oh, some, like a friend of his went to drop something off at his house. Like, I don't know, whatever it was. He just like, just to deliver, like just from the door. And he said, like, and the wife wouldn't open the door. So he wasn't sure. So the person's not sure whether anybody's home. So he's phoned his friend and said, look, listen, is anybody home? I'm trying to deliver this. So he said, my wife ought to be home. Let me phone her. So he phones her and she's at home. And he says, can you open the door? Because there's this guy there and, you know, can you, he's going to deliver this. So she says, no. He's not a mahram. And this guy was like really proud of this. Like, wow. Like, wow. <laughs> I was like, what the hell? You, you guys are psychotic. You need some serious. <laughs> what the hell? Like, why are you so distrustful of her? And why is she so distrustful of herself? Like what? Is that how it works? Like what? Like you open a door, you see a guy and it's straight on what she's going to have sex with him or something. Like how? <laughs> what are, how does the how does the how do these people see the world? Like, do they think every time a, a woman like if she just sees a man, it will be instantaneous on the spot? Like people just. You know, like with Velcro or whatever, they just rip their clothes open <laughs> and it's just full on, full passion. <laughs> Is this what they... <laughs> if that's the case, then okay, I'm prepared to move out of Birmingham and move to... <laughs> Where is this place that these people live, man? I mean... <laughs> So I, I don't get the, the why people get Relax, so angry, man. <laughs> I mean, that's not quite how. <laughs> but, uh, but yeah, so we start to mask our insecurities with religion, and we start to say that this is uh, this is a, a good thing. Like you know, this is like oh, this is like rira and honor, and no, it isn't. It's just insecurity, man. That's just really weird. <laughs> it's just like you're just really distrustful. Of yourself and of other people I just want to know what, how things in your inside your mind actually work but yeah trust me all the men are wishing if only <laughs> if only the world was like that <laughs> people would just be knocking on random doors <laughs> it'd be like a full-time job like I'd get up and <laughs> just, just knocking on different doors every day <laughs> Ah, uh, the world would be an interesting place, I must say. <laughs> but anyway, uh, no, 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 no. It wasn't the wearing the hijab thing. It was the the fact. It wasn't that she wasn't wearing hijab was the issue. It's the fact that she said, "I refuse to even engage a non-mahram." <laughs>